fucking piece of filth with the uneasy out of the back. Yeah, what is that? What am I doing? Kill me. For Rachel, once she gets into the folds, it'll be getting off that left and wrapping that left arm and, and just staying grounded through the finish. She's, yesterday we've got, she had some throws yesterday where she just sat through that finish really, really well. Um, Sam, same thing, being patient and double support out of the back, fast off that left, patient in the middle, because if he's patient in the middle, he gets a really, really long pull and he can just rip it. And then with Lucas, it's just getting that patient out of the back where he lets his hips drop and he stays low out of the back and he doesn't pop up. So that helps him transfer forward a little bit better on a, on a more linear path through the finish. So that's what we're working on now. That's what we're working on for the next three months, really. Rachel, Sam, and Luke, all three of them, all three are focusing on like very small details that I think are gonna really transfer to big throws. But the, the big thing is, is that they have the, the principles set, like the principles of the technique and the technical model that we use are, are all fairly established in, in their movement right now. So it's sort of like, it's like such instead of starting at square one with their technique, um, like we might have done a, two years ago and definitely did last year. Now, now we're at at this point of you know we're three to four months ahead as far as continuing to develop their their technical progress. So for this point of the year, all three of them are throwing really well technically, um, which I think is going to result in huge throws during the season from all three of them. I, I mean. Dude, some of Sam's throws right now look like 65 plus meter throws and, and Rachel's been killing it as far as technical progress. So it's pretty exciting to see to see how their comprehension of the movement has, has really matured over the last year to two years. goal is that I want Lucas to throw 20 meters as the first step I want Rachel Don't cross oh. yourself up when you're loading in the back oh. well you're loading yeah, like I am this. Doing that. bullshit fucking high school um, Rachel's first steps throw 60 feet then after that it's just gonna be blow up festival uh, Sam I think same thing hit a big PR Hit a big PR, throw bombs indoors, and then I think he's capable of some serious, serious distances this year. I think he hits a PR, maybe throw 70. Um, I think that that I think that's the goal. Is that all of them have like that immediate goal? Lucas 20 meters, uh, Rachel 60 feet, uh, Sam you know 67, 50, and then after that just snowball into into a big season. Because I think they're all. They're all getting it. They all understand the. They all understand the process and the system. And I'm trying to communicate better with them 
to further improve our, our communication and Rachel's laughing at me because that's part of our deal for this weekend but I think from a coaching perspective it's just getting that point across all the time and communicating communicating each week what is our technical goal and then what's the physical goal in the weight room and then in the circle okay a little faster left leg now while the left arm wraps to the van Yeah, I like the right, but too tall. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, that actually feels good. <laughs> 